Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Tuesday's Daily Financial Digest. Mt. Gox is preparing to repay creditors through the Bitstamp cryptocurrency exchange, according to the latest on-chain fund movements. The address associated with Mt. Goss has executed the first test transactions to the Bitstamp cold wallets. Gold prices fell to a more than one week low as the dollar firmed, while traders awaited more US economic data and comments from Federal Reserve officials this week for clarity on the timeline for interest rate cuts. The S&P 500 and the Nasdaq recouped some of the previous week's losses as investors re-examined the chances of a second presidential term for Republican nominee Donald Trump after US President Joe Biden pulled out of the race. The oil dollar pair plummeted 1% in the last session. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The pound dollar pair traded sideways in the last session. The ultimate oscillator is giving a negative signal. The Bitcoin dipped a slight 0.2% against the dollar in the last session. The RSI is giving a positive signal. The last session saw the gold drop 0.6% against the dollar. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The US Red Book Index will be released at 12.55 GMT. The US existing home sales at 14 GMT, the US two-year note auction at 17 GMT. The Eurozone's consumer confidence will be released at 14 GMT, the Eurozone's Eurogroup meeting at 7 GMT, the Dutch consumer confidence adjusted at 0430 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Tuesday's financial report. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.